Hello? If you're going to be nice and take your clothes off, why don't you come up to Harpo's? Dick fucker. Take my clothes off and go up to Harpo's? Why don't you come up to Harpo's? Ask for Justine. Because it's 1.30 and Harpo's isn't serving? No. I'm assuming that you're drunk, which makes it even better. No, I'm actually rather sober. So if you guys want to come on down here, come on down here. To a closed bar? If you want to come, it's really fun. It's really fun to be at the closed bar. Get your ass on down here, down here to uh, the bar and we'll talk more than what you want to. We will talk. March on ass on down here and bring your fucking sorority girls. I have no problem telling you how gross that is that you're one to spread it. And nobody else would feel the same way that you're willing to spread it. That's kind of gross. What, a, what the fuck are you talking about? I mean, and my story sister just said, that's kind of gross that you're willing to spread it among, amongst the people. That's really gross. I mean, that's kind of selfish. I mean, I don't know how you feel. Well, you, you keep saying spread it, and I don't know what the fuck that means. So if you guys want to come down, down here, come on down here. Why? The bar is closed. No. Dicks, dicks, fucker. No, I don't suck dicks. You're, you're gay. Yeah, I'm not. And frankly, the people who used to call these payphones at, at bar clothes, they used to be a lot funnier. Ass fuck? Yeah, no, I don't do that either. Why do you keep calling a payphone on a Friday night at 1 o'clock in the morning? I'm at the payphone. Why do you keep calling it? Why did you call my phone? Why did I answer? Dude, it was a fucking payphone. I just answered because it was ringing, you dickwad. I answered because, again, the people who used to call this phone had a better sense of humor. Go ahead, honey. Where are you at? I'm at the payphone you called. If you want to come, it's really fun. Okay, sweetheart? Um, I'm not your sweetheart, and Harpo's is closed. It's 1.30. They can't no. sell booze. Why would I want to go there? No. Okay. No. Yeah, no. No. Yeah, it is. I cannot buy alcohol there. No. No, I can't. That's for you're, Justine. You're right. I'll text you later. You're fun. Text you later. Bye. How are you going to text me later? This is a fucking payphone. No. Hello? Give me, you are still on the phone. I can still hear you, but not know what you're saying, but please continue talking, because this is totally amusing to me. Well, I'm sorry that you're easily amused. You might want to try reading a book once in a while. No. Oh, you're illiterate. No? Wait, you can read? Yes. And you're calling payphones for fun? Dude, it was a fucking payphone. I just answered because it was ringing, you dickwad. Why don't you get a fucking Wait a second. metal are rod you, up your are ass? Are you on 8th Street right now? No. Come really? Us. You're not calling one payphone from the other payphone? Because I'm no. on a payphone right now. No. Are you a very bad liar? No, bitch. No, you're a bitch? I didn't catch that. Why don't you get a fucking metal rod up your ass if you're going to be a dick like that? I'm not being a dick. I just want to figure out what the fuck's going on. So if you guys want to come on down here, come on down here. Come on down to Harpo's? Okay. 
Okay, is that an answer? Yes. Is that where you are? Yes. Because you said you were on a payphone. Carlos. And there are only two payphones in Colombia, and they're around the corner from each other. Really? Yes, really. They're by the fucking phone company. <laughs> I don't know what I... What, did you hang up? If you guys want to come on down here, come on down here. Come on down to where? Harpo's. Really? Really? Because you see, it's past the legal time that bars can serve alcohol. No. Yes. No, bitch. Yes, bitch. No. No. Yes. Honey. I mean, it's after 1.30 uh, in Columbia, Missouri. That is when they stop serving booze. Honey, no. Wait, you know? No. No? That's a cute eye tree for the barn, okay? What now? That's a cute eye tree for the barn, okay? I heard no fuck you I tree for the barn. Okay. So you tree for the barn. No. Because that's what I've been hearing. You have to understand, I'm on a shitty payphone from the 50s. That's what you <laughs> know. I don't know what I... No? Yeah, that's what I'm ca talking to you on right now. This is an, an anachronism. It is something out of time that only exists because the phone company is right fucking here. No. I'm standing on Locust Street. I could walk to Harpo's. Yes. But I'm well past CenturyLink and the candy factory. That seems like a waste of time since Harpo's will not serve me alcohol. And I have red hair. I am whiter than you know. As for Justine... Wait, what did you just say? As you have Justine. red hair and you're whiter than I know? Yes. Why the fuck does that matter? As for Justine... Huh? As for Justine... Something about Justine? Justine... I mean, I'm talking on a phone that gets rained on. Like, I cannot make out what you're saying, and what I can make out sounds like a whole heap of bullshit. Because that's really nasty that you're spreading amongst your sorority sisters. I'm just throwing that out there. I'm sorry, what? Because that's really nasty that you're spreading amongst your sorority sisters. I'm just throwing that out there. What sorority sisters? And what second you... of all, it's not very nice that you spread it to everybody else and that you spread it to your own sorority girls. I have no clue what you're talking about now. And seriously, um, and my the people sorority... who used to call these payphones were a lot funnier. And, and my sorority sister just said, that's kind of gross that you want to spread it amongst, amongst the people. That's really gross. I mean, that's kind of selfish. I mean, I don't know how you feel. Did you hang up? No. Okay. Because there are a whole bunch of clicks and whistles on this side. Um, seriously, I'm standing, literally speaking through a payphone on Cherry Street, and I have no desire to go to Harpo's since they're not serving booze. You're, you're gay. Actually, no. I'm very straight. I just uh, find intelligence attractive. And you have exhibited none. But you sound like a dick fucker. No, I actually really, really love licking pussy, eating a girl out, and fucking slamming my big old dick in there. But you just kind of sound like a dick. Why don't you come up to Harpo's? Ass fuck. Why don't you fucking sit on a dick? Why don't you 
fucking yeah, pull that fucking... shit out of your ass and fucking try and get a dick up there. Why don't you get a fucking metal rod up your ass if you're going to be a dick like that? Wow, you're useless. Oh, Jake did you hang fucker? up that time? No. I'll talk to you later. You're fun. Talk to you later. Bye. Oh, are you going to call here again? Because, no. this is useless. You are Love calling me, seriously a payphone. Bye. And people who used to do that were funny. Bye. Oh, really? Bye. Seriously, work on me. Work on your material. If you're going to call a fucking payphone and hope that people pick it up, God damn, have something funny to say. Bye. You're useless. You have no redeeming value. You should probably go kill yourself. No. No? Don't kill yourself? No. Don't okay, really call then this fucking learn payphone. to be funny if you're going to prank call random people. This, this chick right here agreed that we Wait, are going to put chick some right where? I can't see what the fuck you're doing. Flaming hot and thick up your ass. So uh, you uh, Lauren speaking. No, okay. Scratch what I said earlier, because you're now just stealing my phrases and trying to use them against me. Think about this. If you're going to call a random-ass fucking payphone, fucking have something to say other than, Come to Harpo's! Oh my god, come to Harpo's! You're just a fucking moron. Fuck you! Fuck you and fuck you again! Holy shit, is, is this Chloe? No, Justine. Justine, oh damn, do you know Chloe? No. Because Chloe is an ignorant twat too. Really? Yeah, no, you'd like her. You two would get along. You would think, oh my god, we're going to prank call. A telephone booth? Because, oh my god, who uses a payphone anymore? Oh my god. You know, I'm really mad at my boyfriend because he came in my ass. And all I really want to do is get revenge. But I don't know how. Let's crank call him. Have some more welcome going. <laughs> uh, you know what I... This oh, you is really one? fun. Who's fired? That's really fun. What now? Fun. What's fun? Carpos! <laughs> well, you're wrong, but okay. <laughs> I'm guessing if you went to the doctor, you probably at least have three STDs, because you seem like you'd fuck anything that would appreciate you. Oh, I'm sorry. You, you're trying to turn my argument against you. And that's just not fair. See, it was my argument to begin with. Idiot. I would just say, with your herpes infection, I heard the word herpes. That's all I yeah, heard. I, I heard you. You you're may shouting. want to uh, get pills and you see a doctor. I am not free men or anything, no but I, I hate penises, and I'm just going to tell you like that you. most of them have herpes. Oh, I'm sure you do, sweetie. Maybe you should get checked. I am guessing that you have HIV. 50% of the people who have it actually don't even know. And if you're, like, sleeping with a bunch of, you know, dark people, the chances of you having it are really well. Wait, I'm sorry. Did you say if I don't like sleeping with a bunch of dark people? Yes. So you're saying black people. You're being racist now. No. We have an Abarak translator here for me. So he, you tell him what you're saying, he'll translate it and turn it into white terms. There you go. No, I'm sorry, I don't... Hello? I tried a man who said he could translate Ebonics, and then I had an African-American woman come up to me, and I'm like, yes, you translate. She has no fucking clue what you're saying. I'm white. I don't speak Ebonics. Uh, again, I'm white. I'm speaking perfect English. Um, my mother was actually an English teacher. Listen, I don't understand Ebonics. 
I get it. You said that. You're kind of a moron, so I'm going to repeat it. I'm speaking perfect English. I'm sorry you're stupid. Jimmy, you, you are still on the phone. I can still hear you but not know what you're saying, but please continue talking because this is totally amusing to me. No, you dumb twats are amusing to me. Yeah, I feel awful. I feel very awful. No, I'm going to say that you're, you're just a, making shit up. You can't make up words. And I told to help you. You wanted to help me? Yes. Is, is that it? By telling me to go to Harpo's? Yes. How would that fucking help me? That's really fun. No, it's not. It's a bunch of tragic fucking wannabes standing around paying way more money than they should for drinks. No. Yes, I've been there. No. Yeah, that dumb bitch. What's the red hair? I don't know. Hold on, is your hair red? Yes. Hold on, there's... Three fucking guys that you would probably love to talk to. Really? She's a dumb twat. Okay. Hold on. Yeah? You, anybody? Dumb twat? No, three fucking bros just walked by and they don't want to talk to you. So what the fuck's your deal? Bye. Oh, did you hang up now? Bye. Oh, come on. Don't be like that. There are three bros who are asking if you're at Harpo's and saying, did she have red hair? Yes! Oh, I have a thing for redheads, but not redheads with herpes. No? I don't want your herpes. Come on, come here, syphilis. What's come that? You have syphilis? Come in. No! Well, which is it? Do you have syphilis or herpes? No! I'm not the asshole that's one to fight in. What's that? I'm not the asshole that's one to fight in. Wait, who's the redhead? Lawrence, uh, Lawrence speaking. Wait, there's a redhead? Are you the redhead? Yes! Because three guys just walked by and asked if I was talking to the girls at Harpo's and if it was the redhead who had herpes. No? Seriously, they were all in pastel button-down shirts and fucking cargo shorts. They were your fucking people. Put your ass on down here, down here to, um... Uh... I'm Is not getting my ass happened? anywhere near you. Contact the health department and they'll ask you. And they'll, and no, you'll no, tell no. Them and they'll say, you oh, contact the heart health the department. Report. They so, volunteered I'm that you, the redhead, had herpes. I that was their contribution, contribution to our conversation. I'm Apparently they I'm met you at Harpo's and you told them you had herpes. No. Really? Because you, I mean, if you're calling a payphone in the middle of the fucking night, you probably have herpes. No. Really? Okay. I mean, really. I'm telling you, I'm from a nurse from, like, people that are actually in the health experience. You can spread it. Wherever they say it's not true. We're no, they, they said that the redhead it. who was calling a payphone from Harpo's had herpes. They're talking about you, sweetie. Three Wait, dudes. I can't one pink shirt, shirt, one yellow shirt, do. one blue polo. So I'm getting tired of this, and I have a bit of walking to do. Do you have uh, anything relevant to say? Because right now, everyone I've talked to has been a worthless twat. Bye. Bye. That's it. Bye. Not Bye. even defending yourself on the herpes thing. Bitch. Bye. Oh, you're a bitch. I knew that already. No. I'll talk to you later. You're fun. Talk to you later. Bye. Are you, out of curiosity, are you the same three girls that I have already berated twice for saying that the people who used to call these phones were a lot funnier? No. Are you sure? Yes. Are you really sure? Really? Yes. Because I pick up these phones for fun. Because it's usually an ignorant twat on the end. <laughs> I don't know what I... Yellow? I don't know what I... Bye. 
No, no, hold on. One moment. If I pick up next time, and if I ask if you're the redhead with herpes, can I run down to Harpo's and meet you? Yes! Just so I can point and laugh and say that's the redhead with herpes who has nothing better to do than call one of the remaining fucking payphones in town? Yes! Okay. And I can just piss on your face? Because, I mean, if you've already got herpes, why the fuck not? Yes! Really? Really? Wow. You just have no shame. You are that much of a useless twat, and you're well aware of it. <laughs> uh, you know what I... Oh, you hang up again? Bye. Oh, don't say bye. 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 You're so pathetic that I'm interested. Bye. 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 No, no, you're, you're just so tragic that I'm fantastically amused by this. You're a joke. <laughs> no, 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 honey. You're the slut, the red-headed slut at Harpo's. Harpo's? Who is the joke? You're a joke. No, no, you're a pathetic piece of shit. I'm not the joke. That would be you. No? You, thus far, you have nothing to offer humanity, whereas I'm just walking home and happen to answer a phone and tell you that you are a useless piece of shit. And the thing is, your personality is dry and it's shitty. And oh, no, it's no very one wants to be just be I friends with you. you. Don't have a real when people are like, team. hey, we should just be friends, what they mean by that is, hey, let's sleep next door to each other until you let me put it in your ass. Wow, good comeback. Great sense of humor there. Bitch. You you clearly don't understand very much about the dynamics of humor. You I'm guessing by virtue of how stupid you have behaved in this conversation, you don't understand much about anything. <laughs> how old are you? See, I was going to guess 15, but with a fake ID. No? Oh, I'm pushing buttons. It's so hard. Mm. You trying to call someone else? No? Okay. I can sit here and listen to a retard mash buttons all night. I <laughs> know what I... Blah, blah, blah. Bye. See, what I hear is, oh, my God, you keep talking. Oh, my I'm God. I'm not saying anything. Oh, my because God. Because you don't I'm have anything agreeing. to say. Oh, my God. Because you're a moron. Oh, my God. I know that's what you think, okay? Congratulations. Okay, I'm sorry. What, what are you majoring in? That's a cute eye tree for the barn, okay? You what? That's a cute eye tree for the barn, okay? You tree for the barn? Okay. No, I, I don't know what that means. You tree for the barn? Okay, What is that us? fucking... Tree per the barn. Yes. I don't understand what you're fucking saying now because your girlfriends are laughing and you're on speakerphone, you fucking moron. Listen, I don't understand Ebonics. Listen. There is no Ebonics. I'm repeating what I heard you say, you dumb bitch. I don't speak Ebonics. I don't either. I'm speaking perfectly clear English. When I say Look, dumb listen, bitch... if you're looking for it, friendship, you, might, you may just want to go screwing everyone. I'm sorry, what? Bye. I might want to ghost roll everyone? Bye. No, I, I'm trying to figure out what the fuck you said. Bye. Yeah, I heard that one. I was asking ghost roll the prime? Like, what? Bye. You silly bitch. Bye.
Do you understand, silly bitch? Yes. Okay. You're a silly bitch. And seriously, very seriously, if you're going to call random fucking pay phones and hope people pick it up, say something worthwhile. Make it funny. Don't just be a dumb drunk bitch. Okay? Can you do that? Can okay. We make, can yes. Can you make answering a random ringing payphone worthwhile? Yes. Instead of just being a stupid fucking cunt who doesn't understand the English language? Yes. Okay. Well then, next time it's ringing, I hope you've got something better to say. Bye. Bye.